Good morning, it's Lorata K and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be getting ready with you guys and I'm going to be taking you guys through my week. So it's going to be a week of school. So I don't think this week is going to be as hectic when it comes to like um, going to classes as much. But so we're going to be going through this week together. So I'm going to quickly shower and then I'll be back so that we can start getting ready together. I want to do like... I want to be so intentional this week so i want to make myself look a little bit more enhancedly pretty so i'm gonna like put on makeup and everything that's what i want to do like not too much makeup obviously like natural makeup i'm gonna be putting on my contact lenses i just want to be intentional about having them on this week i don't know okay i'm not gonna do a shower montage or like skin care stuff i'll probably like do a separate video for that like I don't know when but catch y'all when I do my face and then we can talk <laughs> okay I just got out the shower and it was a good shower it ended up being longer than I intended it to be because it was so good I put on my contact lenses so I'm like a little bit teary eyed tearing my eye and stuff like that so I'm gonna put on something I don't know, I'm just gonna put on something while I think of an outfit to wear and then I'm gonna quickly like get my face done because I'm already late. Well, 30 minutes, I have 30 minutes to get ready, which is enough time, but it's not enough if I have to think of an outfit to wear. But I have an idea of what I wanna wear, it's a Monday, so we're not gonna be so dramatic about our outfits. I'm just gonna just like, chilled and i don't like to make an effort on a monday but for some reason i always make an effort on a monday so today is going to be a different day and i'm going to try not to make too much of an effort okay i am back i'm watching lexi v in the background she is literally my inspiration into getting into youtube like as a kid like i used to watch her videos and i was like bit i thought i was going to have time to like shape my eyebrows so i have this uh eyebrow razor got it from fashini and it was 70 rand so i thought i was gonna have time to like shape my eyebrows but like i told y'all i only i only have 30 minutes so i need to get ready right now but we're gonna do a quick makeup situation i got my sponge i got my Mascara, my eyebrow shapener, and my concealer is here. I forgot to bring my um, con my setting, whatever, to set my face. But I forgot what I said I was actually going to talk about when I sit here. Like, I really just had something in mind. And I have my mirror here to look at myself when I'm getting ready. I start with my eyebrows and then I go on with the rest of my face. So I really had a topic for us to talk about. I was like, oh, we're going to talk about this. And I forgot. I literally forgot what I was going to talk to you guys about. But I was like, since I forgot, <laughs> let's just do the verse of the video together. Um, I really don't know where this verse of the video is at. I found this verse of the video from like a sermon. Yes, I found it. I found it. So the verse of the video is in Acts 13 verse 38. And like when he shared this verse, like literally this pastor, I forgot his name. But I know like Debbie remembers because she has a good memory on this. So the pastor like, oh, my eyebrow looks so thick today. So the pastor read this verse like in the beginning and like literally flew over our heads like we did not get it like not saying we did not get it but you know sometimes when you read the bible you're just reading it and you just like oh yeah and then you like just move on and then he literally was like i'm gonna tell you this one thing and like this is one thing that most christians are not doing enough and we we're like okay and it's like this is what paul did and we we're like okay what is it you know and then he's like, do you want me to tell you? We're like, okay, yeah, tell us. <laughs> you know, we were like thinking, yo, Paul said something crazy. Well, he did. But it is so simple, but yet like 
how did we miss that like how did we miss that and it is so true on how we don't like share this enough you know we do share it i feel like as christians we do but we don't share it as enough as we should and like a part of the thing that he the verse that he read and he says like we don't share enough that paul said is from acts 13 ver chapter <laughs> acts 13 verse 38 and it says brothers listen we are here to proclaim that through this man jesus there is forgiveness for sin like take a pause what we need to tell more christians this like in our everyday life that like through jesus we have forgiveness for sin like because i feel like a lot of people suffer through sin like they feel guilty about the things they that they have done that they feel like ain't no way i am forgiven or like try to understand how are they forgiven and we will never understand god's grace and mercy upon our lives because it's that big but like literally just telling somebody on your in your everyday life like just a simple hey listen jesus through jesus your sins are forgiven like even also the phrase that jesus loves you i feel like it is so beautiful that we just need to share it a bit more often with other people like instead of like judging them or telling them you're doing this wrong you're doing that wrong da, 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 da. you should fix this you should fix that literally just tell them through jesus your sins are forgiven like through this man jesus listen you were good and i found it like so beautiful and it stood out for me so much because i'm like i've never like necessarily thought of telling people that like yeah i will tell people that jesus loves you but i've never really thought of telling people like through through jesus your sins are forgiven because i think in a sense i always thought because when you get saved you know that like you think that everybody knows that like oh because i'm saved you know salvation freedom free from sin and stuff like you think you know it's like a given like you know but my um deputy principal from my high school always used to tell us that common sense is not common for everybody so you should not assume that if you know something and it's it feels common to you that everybody else knows it you know and i'm just like damn i put too much concealer this side <sighs> so y'all okay i got 20 minutes because i've been rambling on but yeah that is the verse of the video and i want to encourage us like if you are like still watching this part of the video that please y'all we need please i say please so weirdly we need to literally start just being mm -mm, that is not the middle of my nose <laughs> wait Ugh. my proportions are off like but anyway i was gonna say that we need to like be more intentional about letting people know that through jesus we are forgiven because there are people out there you know walking around not knowing that through jesus they're forgiven and we just need to reiterate that and if somebody already knows then it can be like a conversation spark of like your understanding of like you know jesus forgiving you and everything so acts 13 verse 38 y'all and you can literally read down because it just gets better the more you read it like don't just stop there so y'all so that is my share for today. I gotta say y'all, I'm starting to really, really feel this red. It looks so good. Like the more I sit and I just stare at myself with this color, like mostly on camera though, not on in the mirror, but in this bun, it looks so good. Like the black and the red is giving. It is honestly giving what it needs to give. I like it, I like it. It's almost class time right now. I'm not even sure if I have this class at this time. But I'm gonna get ready like I do have the class. And if I don't have the class, then I look so pretty and I will start, you know, with my day. Things I would have done when I got back from class. So this is the setting powder. So this is the Revlon setting powder. For my concealer, I use this Maybelline. It's almost finished, y'all. Literally, like, focus. 
this Fit Me Maybelline um, concealer, and then I use the LA Girl concealer. This is my favorite. I really like the LA Girl concealer. I can't wait to try this one. This is the L'Oreal concealer, inflammable. <laughs> Looks really nice, and I feel like I'm gonna get like proper coverage with this one. And then for my mascara, I use this Rimmel London um, mascara. And then my eyebrows, y'all know, LA girl, brow bestie, come on. <laughs> and this is the shade medium brown, but my go-to shade, the true color to my eyebrows is the soft brown. So if you're my skin shade and you want to get a brow thingy, but that is not too dark, but fits your color perfectly, then this LA Girl soft brown works. But if you don't find soft brown, then medium brown also works, but you gotta be a little bit lighter with this one. You can't necessarily go as heavy, you know, in your coverage because it is that dark. So you wanna have it blend with your eyebrows and not necessarily stand out from your eyebrows, you know what I'm saying? So yeah, so I'm gonna quickly go get ready off camera and I'll come back to show you guys the final look and everything on camera. Don't forget the verse of the video, y'all. Acts 13 verse 38 shared with people okay and let Jesus do the rest of the work because he will through the Holy Spirit Okay, so I actually just got back from class because I ended up, well, I finished on time. I was actually pretty early, um, but Nolo and CK wanted to meet me, so I couldn't, like, do much, but this is my fit. I had to, like, change outfits a bit. So yeah, so this is my outfit. My my background is looking a little bit messy. I'll clean it up quickly. Jar. That is how your girl is looking. And then my face, I did not do the lip thingy like I thought I would. But yeah, and then I tried to do baby hairs. That did not turn out the way I thought it would because I did them in a hurry. I got myself treated. I was on special at Pick and Pay, like two for 35 grand. So I'm so excited. I love me some tuna, honey. Okay, tuna, tuna. I love me some tuna. It's the bomb. Dot com. Okay, and then I also went to Zigmart. Let me do a haul for y'all. I did not get much, but I went to Zigmart. I feel like sitting down for this. I was running out of dishwashing soap, so I got the one they had there. This was like 10 rand. <laughs> I got myself a gloss. I think it looks cute. So I just got this and then I'm like, you know what? Next time I'll probably get another one. And this was like 8 Rand 90. And then all the other fancy looking ones were like going up to like 20 Rand and 30 something Rand. And I'm going to show you guys what Nola got me. So I got these light meat shredded tuna in salt water. Let us dig into what Nola got me. I haven't gotten the chance to look at it. So <sighs> baby, uh, I'm going to run to her room right now and give her a hug. And then she got me an Oreo. <laughs> Oreo biscuit with the chocolate coated one, honey. And then I got a crunchy. Uh, um, <laughs> and then she got me a this, honey. She got me some built tongue. Okay. <laughs> Cause I also, I was like, listen, if I ever become sad or it feels like I'm going through something, please just give me some built tongue. <laughs> I'm sorry, I love because I, I remember telling her, she was like, mm, okay. Like, she was not bothered at all. She did not seem like she would do it. And I actually thought this was the only thing she was going to get me. Because, I mean, that's all I requested for. But she got me 
so much more i'm gonna literally run downstairs and give her like the tightest hug ever because when she gave me this i didn't give her a hug i was like thank you but now i'm gonna thank you <laughs> anyway y'all catch y'all when i actually have something productive to do instead of waste your time so but i did not waste your time because we enjoy sitting together when laws if we just have a moment like this i don't know so Tuesday today and I already went to class just oh uh, I got back a long time ago so I'm gonna do my school work plus it's lo load shedding soon so it's actually the perfect time to just sit and concentrate Thank you. 